One symptom of a bad outer tie rod end is that when you hold it in the 9 o'clock position and 3 o'clock position, and when you wiggle it, there is some play on the tire. Let's fix that right now. Hello and welcome to How to Helen, where you learn something different every day. In this episode, we will be replacing the outer tie rod end on this 2002 Chrysler PT Cruiser. Now, I already jacked up the car to save us some time. Start by loosening up the 22mm jam nut on the outer tie rod end. Now that it's loosened up, take out the 18 millimeter nut at the bottom of the outer tie rod end. This is the same size as your lug nuts. With the outer tie rod end nut out, lightly or gently tap the outer tie rod end to take it out of the hub assembly. Turn the outer tie rod end counterclockwise to remove it, but make sure you count the number of turns that you use so when you put the new one in, you will use the same number of count to make it as close as possible to the current alignment. So let's do that right now. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 36 and a half. Here's a side-by-side -side comparison of the old outer tie rod end and the new outer tie rod end. The old one, this is very loose compared to the new one. This one, I can barely move it. So this is really due for a replacement. Now let's put in the new outer tie rod in. So we'll count 36 and a half. I'll start with a half. Half. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. Eleven. Twelve. Thirteen. Fourteen. Fifteen. Sixteen. Seventeen. Eighteen. Nineteen. Twenty. Twenty-one. Twenty-two. Twenty-three. Twenty-four. Twenty-five. Twenty-six. Twenty-seven. Twenty-eight. Twenty-nine. 35, 36. Now let's put it in the hub assembly. Gently tap it in.
This is completely optional, but you can add some thread locker to help keep the knot securely in place. Start by hand tightening the knot to prevent it from cross-threading. Since the new outer tie rod end came with a pin, let's put it in. Now let's tighten the jam nut. And that is how you replace the outer tie rod end on this 2002 Chrysler PT Cruiser. This has been another episode of How to Helen. My name's Arja, and thank you for watching.